Local party committees organize every four years during the presidential primary. Detailed information about how to organize a party committee is available online at the state's elections division. After determining the members of the local party committee, the committee can complete an organizational statement provided by OCPF. Copies of the completed statement are filed in four locations. The committee must always have a treasurer to raise or spend money. During a calendar year, the aggregate contribution limit from an individual to a party committee or committees is $5,000. Contributions of more than $50 for the year must be itemized on campaign finance reports. Contributions of $50 or less for the year can be reported as a lump sum, though OCPF recommends itemizing all donors. Cash contributions are allowed up to $50 per person, but the names and addresses for cash donors must be kept in the committee's records. Contributions of $200 or more for the calendar year must include the occupation and employer of the donor. Committee funds must be kept in a campaign bank account. A political party may make expenditures for the advancement of the party and its candidates. Parties typically spend money on such things as contributions to candidates, printing, and postage, and food for party events. Most expenditures by parties are direct contributions to candidates. The annual contributions limit for a party to a candidate is $1,000. However, local party committees can make unlimited in-kind contributions to candidates. For example, a city's party committee can spend $5,000 on a mailing to support a city council candidate. This is Reporter 7, OCPF's filing system. Party committees must identify candidates in Reporter 7 when in-kind expenditures are made to support candidates. Please reach out to the candidates you helped to let them know they received an in-kind contribution. A local party committee is required to file a campaign finance report with OCPF if they have more than $100 in activity in a reporting period. However, OCPF recommends filing reports even if the $100 threshold is not met, especially for committees with balances. During state election years, local party committees file reports eight days before the state primary and eight days before a state election. Local party committees file year-end reports each January 20. Committees can e-file reports using Reporter 7.